everyone, thank you very much for your interest and for watching my video. My name is Maria Rupert, lawyer and arbitrator with a base in Dubai and offices in Spain and in, in Egypt. Today I would like to answer a question that I received a few weeks back because I think um, that may be of interest to, to many viewers. The question is, uh, the, the question was coming from Latin America, uh, was a mother, uh, she was planning to travel with her family in August to the UAE and um, the, the question was relating to the upcoming uh, maternity of her daughter. The daughter of the, of the person texting me was uh, a single mother. So our question today is, can single mothers travel to the UAE? The question is yes, nothing should happen, okay? It's true that as per the, the law, um, fathers should authorize travels, and this may be, may be the case of uh, UA residents. If you are a UA resident and you want to take your kid to school, the school is going to ask you for, for the father authorization. So it's not the case for uh, travelers, for visitors coming in. Usually you come to the airport, you come with a kid, nothing happens. They could ask, in principle, they could ask and say, who's this kid? Well, this kid is mine, and what about the father? Is he traveling with you? Oh no, he's not traveling with me. The, the rational, you can say, uh, nothing ever, ever happens. But sometimes, sometimes, um, I, I don't have, I don't have, uh, I don't have any single instance of, uh, of a case similar to this, but in principle, it could happen. Uh, nothing ever happens when you drink in Dubai, and sometimes, uh, you get knocked on the door of your house and that person has no license. And it never happens, but sometimes, sometimes. So in order to anticipate to that sometimes, sometimes, um, what I proposed uh, to, to this future uh, grandmother was, listen, what you can do is you can go to the police in your, in your home country, I believe it was uh, Argentina, you can go and, and get, an, uh, and, and your daughter can give an authorization to you, for example, for traveling. So, or she can travel with an authorization to herself to travel. So if they ask, well, I have an authorization here to travel, and that's the maximum that could happen, right? Because you are a visitor. So with that, you are completely, completely uh, safe. Without it, chances are that nothing will happen, but you want to be 100% sure, uh, get this piece of paper. In, uh, in some jurisdictions, you go to the police, but also uh, get in touch with me in order to double check in your jurisdiction what you need to do. So thank you very much and best of luck. Enjoy Dubai.